Newcastle Falcons today after they failed to raise the money to play next season. Only three of the founding clubs now remain in the league. In 1979, the Newcastle Falcons helped create history with the formation of the National Basketball League. Today, the club became history. NBL Chief John Reimars refused any more extensions for the club to find the necessary finances to enter the coming season. For people like Dennis Kibble, it's a sad day to say the least. It's been my life, it's been my family's life. One of the Falcons' founders, Kibble filled almost every position at the club in his time and had his number retired. Now it has no place to hang and the history shows that no club makes it back into the league. I think the teams that have gone, uh, there's been never another word heard of them. We couldn't find the money, it's going to be uh, this particular time around. Um, it's going to be a lot uh, dearer to get in in a year's time or two years time, whatever the case may be. It was a brave battle to save the club. A consortium trying to raise funds was led by Kibble's sister Helen alongside Jeff Barnett. And while Pat Scammell flew to Melbourne to convince the NBL the Falcons could survive, the fight is now over. It's definitely a sad day for Newcastle in, in general, I think, in that we can't support a, a team of any sport in the, in, the in the National League. Jim Callanan, NBN News Late Edition.